Hey everybody, GL1 here, and today I want to show you what is one of my favorite Transformers and arguably one of the top 10 Transformers I've ever seen, maybe has ever been made. So this is a golden bumblebee with electric lights and sounds. And uh, as it tells you here on the box uh, that it has a flip-down mask, glowing eyes, chest and weapons, revving engine sounds, vehicle battle sounds, and you can unlock different phrases and sounds in robot or vehicle mode. It's random, uh, so you don't know what it's going to say, but here it is in automobile uh, form. And uh, it's, I didn't snap everything together really tight because I'm going to show you what it does. And uh, it, it's really, really cool. So, all right, uh, you have your front wheel here, when you push on the bottom of it, So if you'll remember from the movie, Bumblebee had a uh, damaged uh, voice uh, machine, you know, whatever machine that uh, Transformers use to speak, so he uses the radio to come up with phrases. It's cooperating quite well today. It wasn't doing so much last night. It was mainly just making the engine revving sounds. And there we go. All right, so while it is in a car mode, you can open the doors. All right. And they push in and then snap together. Um, and then you can push this down, and then that'll make a good... Uh, get rid of a lot of the seams, all right? And then what you can do, though, is if you pull that up, this up, and it's not that easy, so I kind of left it. That's why I left it apart. Pull this back, and then you could take these guns out. It's going to make the uh, transforming sound. Pretty cool. And then the other one. Okay, and then there's a button there for to do that, and then you can push this in. Work that in there. Try to get that up there. We go, and push that down. Push that down. Close your doors. And then you have guns there. Idling sound. And it rolls quite well, too. Not bad, you know, for a transformer. And it's very heavily built. So you could see the exhaust in the back. And this is the uh, first generation of the new Camaro. So, you know... Um, Mrs. GL1's favorite version of the Camaro, although there have been some customs that are really, really nice. All right, so I got this in 2010, and um, it was at Marshall's for $35, so I bought two of them. And um, even then, it was compare at 60. Um, so now, this is a very expensive transformer. And here's the one in the box. <clears throat> now, it comes with two AA batteries, which is a mixed blessing. Uh, the good thing is the batteries will, you know, you can play with it, a lot of playability. Uh, you know, the downside is AA batteries don't last in the package very long. You have to worry about them bursting and corroding and ruining your toy. So you can't, you shouldn't leave them in too long. Uh, whereas the button cells, they take a lot longer uh, to have anything go wrong. So I did have to take this off, the sleeve here. Actually, this whole thing, just you can lift it out 
and um, get the batteries out of it because I didn't want that to be a problem. And as it turned out, they were starting to corrode. So, um, and it comes with two mini cons, or yes, uh, they're really not mini cons. They're just small cars. You have a, a small version of a Golden Bumblebee, and then you have a uh, Scion XB, and then those also transform and turn into little robots. All right, so I'm going to transform this, uh, the one I have out of the box, into robot mode and show you all the really, really cool things that this does. So hang on. All right, well, it took a while to transform. Now, it says this is a level four transformer, but uh, it's not easy. So, uh, and you have to be careful not to break it because some of the pieces are really tight. All right, so this is uh, Golden Battle Ops Bumblebee, all right, in warrior form. And uh, here's uh, some of the things he does. All right, so you have two arms, right? And you have this arm here, and you have a thumb that can move for you, and some fingers that flex a little bit, all right? Um, and it's got the ratchet clicking, which is nice. So other than that, you know, nothing special about that other than, you know, just a, a nice, well-made arm. You got your doors flaring back there like guns. And all right, so this is where the electronic sounds, uh, all that fun comes in. So you push this button here, and he will protect you. So his eyes light up. Let me get, try to get a better view of that for you. And his headlights light up. All right. So that's one mode that he does, right? So then what you can do is you put down his war helmet. And then he says all that. So you don't know what he's going to say. All right. So he's got about 20 different phrases and sounds. But this is the cool arm. So this arm here, you have this lever. See this lever? Now this comes on and off. Uh, so for, but to play with it, pull that out and cock that. So he's got his little fingers in here. And they're a little mobile. Okay. And if you straighten the arm out, it's like a long, continuous firing laser sound. And then you can get everything going at once. And All right, and there you are. <laughs> All right, so there is limited edition metallic finish bumblebee. All right, and uh, you have his little balancing toes in the back, kind of like a dinosaur, actually. Oh, actually, you can't see that. Yeah, let me show you. There you go. All right, so these can move in and out, help you balance your toy. It's got nice, uh, not rubber tires, but like a softer plastic. All right, and then you can put these away if you want. And fold those back. Fold his guns back here. Okay. And there you go. The cute bumblebee face that you're used to. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. And uh, I enjoyed showing it to you. And I'll be talking to you soon. Take care.